Hey guys, so this week I've set a few goals for myself that I'm going to try to accomplish and I thought I would take you guys along. The first one is to exercise every single day for 30 minutes. The second thing I'm going to do is fix every meal. I'm still pretty new on this meal plan and I think it will help to really put some effort into fixing every single meal I eat. I'm going to eat it at the table right here without any screens or anything going on to distract me so that I can focus on eating. And after that, I'm going to do the dishes and clean up any mess that I've made so that when I'm done, you know, it's all it's all over. There's nothing to worry about. It's all done. The, my last thing I'm gonna do is set a time to go to bed every night and go to bed at that time every night, whether I feel like it or not. So I'm trying to tie up all the loose ends of kind of a frantic life that had kind of fallen apart so I'm tackling eating, sleeping, and exercise this week, and I will bring you guys along with me, so I hope you enjoy. So I need to exercise for 30 minutes, and I also need to clean up my backyard badly. So why not both? If there's any question if this is going to be a good workout, it is. I just wish my back could keep up with my spirit, <laughs> but it can't, so taking these 15 second rests to let it recover and then going right back at it. Got about 10 minutes left. It's starting to rain, but my phone's waterproof and that's okay because I'm not done. But uh, Dexter is. All right, but let's go inside. Kitty, you don't want no part of this. I'll see you later. All right, here we go. 30 minutes in the bag. I'm almost done. Uh, probably need to take a few passes. But uh, there was a lot of stuff. Um, I've been pretty immobile for quite a while. So uh, there was trash from last year, just kind of with grass growing over it, uh, more than I thought there would be. So that was my first workout of seven days in a row, 30 minutes. Whee! I'm a little sweaty because I just walked my ass all over the Walmart. I'm eating. Eating is the process of taking food, you put it in your mouth, crunching it all up, making it smaller, and then swallowing it down your esophagus. And all the energy inside of it is absorbed for all your body's vital functions. Um, from cell reproduction to you know, going out for a run or whatever you do. Waking up, yawning, tears, all of it requires this energy. So what I'm doing is fueling myself. It's awesome, you guys should try it. On my way to my niece's birthday party and I decided to <clears throat> add, make some exercise out of it. So I'm walking, it's about four blocks. Uh, my back's killing me. I've got my trusty cane, which uh, I can't wait to be rid of, but it's gonna take a little time, which is okay, because I've got a little time. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Good job! Yay! Mm. Would you 
dude! Good party. I didn't partake in the cake and ice cream and cupcakes. And I'm really hungry, so I'm off to walk my way back home. Uh, my niece is on her way over, and she's spending the night tonight, and tomorrow morning I am taking her to school for the first time in a year. So I'm kind of anxious about that, but also excited. And dishes are done, so uh, Thursday's pretty much in the books. Poor little tiger you got there, little Zoe. My name is Tree Trunks. <laughs> I thought um, the Ice King was a Finn and Jake's friend. I thought so. Um, he is sometimes, but this is the first season. And in the first season, they weren't friends yet. Where are we at? I took my niece to school for the first time in a year earlier today and I'm about to go and pick her up right now uh, this is something that I, I wanted to get back to it was the most important short-term goal I had and I'm so glad that I was able to do it um, it was tough my back hurt by the time I got out it takes about eight or nine minutes and there's no rest so it, it wears my back down but as the weight falls off my back will be able to sustain me for a lot longer and eventually I won't have to worry about all this mess but as of right now I'm moving in the right direction and it feels good <laughs> nasty <laughs> I'm push it. here we go Okay, so it's uh, bedtime, and I'm in bed, so this day was a success, my thumb, and on to tomorrow. Eating alone, nothing to watch, just this apple, my new best friend, talk to me apple. Keep me entertained. My mind is racing. It's a new day and a new type of workout. Boom. Um, it's been about 45 to 50 minutes. So a little over my 30 minutes for today. Good workout. Need to clean up my backyard badly. The completed yard, a lot of work, but it's done and it's nice. Feels good. Dexter loves it. He's totally into it. A lot of sweat went into this. Hey guys, so after a really good week, the weekend kind of fizzled out and uh, yesterday I just wasn't feeling it at all and I kind of just sat frozen and allowed the day and night to pass. I didn't work out and I didn't go to bed on time, which is self-sabotaging in every way and it just made me feel like absolute crap. And I have to remind myself, this is how I got into the depths of my depression by allowing my actions to follow how I was feeling instead of having my actions dictate how I'm feeling which is a completely different thing. I'm trying to instill these habits in myself that I need, that I have to have, that are crucial for my success and replacing the habits of just 
chasing instant gratification and avoiding and hiding and cowering away when I know that I should be doing something else. I am going to re-up on my weekly challenge and start it all over tomorrow with the goal of this time sticking to it no matter what. I'm just gonna keep doing this until exercise is something that doesn't feel so scary and bizarre, <laughs> which is what it does now, uh, until it's a habit. 25 minutes in. Uh, I can honestly say that this is a lot better than what I did yesterday. Uh, I still don't really understand why I do the things I do, honestly. Uh, you know, I know it's wrong. I don't know what it is. There's just this freeze button that, that I've gotten used to pushing where I just kind of retreat within myself and I hope it goes away, I guess. I know it doesn't, but I just kind of pretend as if it will. Uh, and that is probably my biggest obstacle right now to try to overcome is to continue and it's kind of the basis of everything I've been trying to do since I started which is to continue forward no matter what regardless of what's going on or how I'm feeling to be able to instill in myself the knowledge that no matter what happens I'm going to continue forward which is absolutely crucial to life really but specifically to a long weight loss journey hey guys so this is my I did a good workout hair hope you like it I think I had a pretty good week even though I had the slip up and the little lazy spell yesterday I more than made up for it today I guess thumbs up is my new thing because I constantly am doing it so from now on boom all right guys thanks for sticking with me and thank you for watching to the end of this video you know who you are thank you